we had a lot of, of people just dumping things in their yards and leaving it. Developing now picking up trash to cut down on crime. That's the goal of a pilot program now expanding into more neighborhoods. News 4 San Antonio's Morgan Burrell shows you why government infighting held this up for nearly a year. And it really, really made the neighborhood look bad. That's a magnet for a crime. It's piles of trash like this left outside homes in the unincorporated Crownwood neighborhood that neighbors are tired of looking at. Of course, it'll make a neighborhood look bad. Especially considering a solution is within reach. There is a mandate and everyone in our neighborhood must have trash service. HOA President Beverly Lee has been working hand in hand with Bear County Commissioner Tommy Kelver to bring a pilot program that seems to be working in the Camelot 2 neighborhood to her own neighborhood and to others. The program brings trash pickup to hundreds of houses. Then charges are tacked onto homeowners power bills. We've been telling our neighbors and helping our neighbors get on board. The holdup has been for nearly a year. Bear County could not find a city utility willing to handle the billing in more neighborhoods. Now there's a solution. The Bear County Solid Waste Program will track and monitor it all. They've made it so easy that anybody can do it. In a statement, Commissioner Calvert tells us he's disappointed. Neither SAWS or CPS Energy stepped up, writing petty political leadership who put personal disagreements and ego over people is why we have no partnerships from the utilities that are supposed to be supporting their customers. Meanwhile, residents are just glad the program is finally moving forward. I want to see a, a clean neighborhood that's safe. And the county is in negotiations with a third party collector so that residents may be able to pay their bills in person at their neighborhood HEB. We'll keep you updated as we learn more about that. But for now, reporting in the Broadcast Center, Morgan Burrell, News 4, San Antonio. Thank you, Morgan. New at 5 with the new school year just days away in some districts, a local group is helping students.